Hi guys, Alex here from Drayton's, here we've got an Audi A4, 2 litre TFSI 35 Sport, finished in Mythos Black Metallic Paint. All of the wheels and tyres are in very good condition, these are 18 inch 10 spoke V design alloys. Uh, the car in general is in really good condition. At the back you get a decent boot with tie down points and the back seats will fold down if you need any extra space in there. Uh, the centre seat will also fold down to give you some through loading if you need it. Uh, this car has got MOT until July 2024 and will come with a full Audi service history. Inside we have the black leather sports seats, decent bolsters on the side and the base to keep you in place. You've also got under thigh support if you need it as well and the leather continues to the rear. Up front we have Audi's new uh, multifunction virtual cockpit. Um, so we've got a few different views you can have. You've got um, the driving data which is currently showing. So you've got your speed on, uh, rev counter on the left, speed on the right and your digital screen in the centre. Currently showing uh, your consumption but you've got uh, stuff like your long term, short term memory for fuel economy, stuff like that. Then we've got your radio media tab, your Bluetooth tab and the nav. So you do have built in nav on the driver's display and if you press the all important view button you do get a nice widescreen view, really nice system, uh, really nice and clear as well. And it's the same for all of them. You've got a widescreen view for all the things, but it makes the biggest difference on the sat nav. Uh, on the main screen, we have Apple CarPlay and Android Auto. So you can have your own phone screen on the screen in the car. You just got to connect via USB. Um, if you prefer just to have your calls and your music coming through, then you can do that just via Bluetooth instead. Uh, you'd also have DAB um, radio, and you've also got the built-in nav as I mentioned before but um, it is a nicely up-to-date system nice and easy to use um, but if you are using CarPlay or Android then you're probably just going to be using Google Maps or Apple Maps or Waze whatever your preferred preference is on there uh, then we've got your car information so this car does have the comfort and sound pack um, so you do get ambient interior lighting which you can see here it's multicolor so you can change it to your favorite color um, as well as keyless entry keyless start um, and a couple of other bits which I'll go through as well. Um, so on the car settings you've got Audi Drive Select, so you've got various different drive modes including an individual setting. Uh, then you've got um, various different settings, your driver assist and stuff, things like that as well. Uh, moving down we have your climate control, so this has got a three zone climate, so you've got temperature for the driver, the passenger and the rear as well. Um, you do also have heated front seats and a heated rear screen. And then just below that we've got your drive select shortcut, engine start stop, stability control and the parking system. Uh, another lovely upgrade with the comfort and sound pack is a 360 camera. Um, so you've got this bird's eye view on the left, it's currently showing the front camera. Um, but if you pop it in reverse it will flip to the rear camera and then change as you go. So it's a really, really nice feature um, and it's really good quality as well, very easy to use. Um, it will come on automatically when you put it into reverse, when you're getting close to things or you can turn it on and off just by pressing the P button there. Uh, we have a 12 volt and a USB input, a couple of cup holders, you push button to start. Uh, this car does come with a six speed manual rather than an automatic but the gearbox is nice and easy to use. Um, the clutch is nice and light as well so when you're crawling through traffic and stuff it's not too much hassle at all. Um, electronic parking brake hill hold assist, a little storage area here, uh, volume and track skip controls there, a uh, little storage space there which does fit the key nice and perfectly as well and then you've got some more storage under here with a USB-C input there as well. The door bins are a decent size um, as is the glove box which is lined with felt so if you've got stuff in there it doesn't rattle around too much. And up front we have a sport steering wheel, uh, so it's nicely laid out. Um, on the left you've got the controls for the driver's display with the view button to switch to widescreen view. And then on the right you've got your volume controls and your hands-free controls. And just down here we've got cruise control and speed limiter, rain sensing wipers, automatic lights and heated and electrically adjustable wing mirrors with electric fold as well. Uh, one of the biggest upgrades with the comfort and sound pack other than the rear view camera is well sorry 360 camera you do get a full surround sound system by Bang & Olufsen which is an awesome uh, surround sound system it's one of the best on the market in my opinion um, 
so yeah, the, if you do like having your music on quite loud and stuff like that, then it's perfect. Um, you do have ice fix anchor points on the outer rear seats, a fold down central armrest, and the through loading, which I mentioned. So the whole center seat will drop down so you can still have one either side and store some longer items in there. And then you've got a temperature control and a 12 volt socket in the rear, as well as some decent door bins. And again, you've got the ambient lighting on there as well. Um, it's a really nice car, it makes a great daily driver, fuel economy is around 42 mpg combined I believe, um, so whether you're doing motorway driving or town driving, um, it's spot on. Um, it will come with 6 months local warranty which can be extended for as little as £199 for an extra 6 months. We also have a range of finance options available, so if finance is something that you're looking for then we can help you out with that as well. If you need any more information on this car or any of the other cars we have in stock, please go to draytons.co.uk. Thank you.